Alright, testing to see how my voice audio is. Alright, my voice is coming through, that's good enough. Alright. So... Just... Uh, sending out tweets, etc. And alright. No. Alright. That should be that. And let's I've been Alright, reach. Let's Les, more. Hmm. Alright. Oh and I can close the Where even is that? What what goal did I set for myself? Uh, no, there's an island here. I kind of want to hit up that. Actually, uh, what what goal have I set, or did it? automatically gets it for me. Oh, is it... Okay, no, I don't have enough. Oh, yeah, I know I was thinking of doing something <clears throat> in kind of reverse order of Zona this this still so no. And I'm trying to remember what's what. Get to one piece. Alright, that 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 said taking out some regions. Still sounds like good idea. What where is that? That's what what mission did Okay, what mission was it wanting me to do? Okay, it's probably this one. Ah, uh, that's it. I kind of want to hit up this one first, just because it... Oh. No, that's a weird one. Yeah. Let's hit that one up. Mm. Alright. Let's head out. Let's forget how to play this game. Let's not forget how to play this game. Actually, since I'm so close to... Let's... Go here first. Oh, and also, I guess I should mention that I, I'm going to try not to use the radio for future streams, or the in-game radio, at least. Because that's, like, 
It's been kind of touch and go on what songs will trigger like copyright, not strikes, but like copyright claims for uh, the YouTube videos. Which is a shame because the music's honestly really fun. So the shame to not be able to jam out to the tunes. Wow. I guess I wasn't fast enough with uh, deploying the parachute. Or the paraglider. Oops. Where? Yeah. Oh. Okay. You know what? That was planned, actually. Um, don't worry about it. Where's the... What? Um... What? Where's the... Th where's the third one? Okay. Well, that's... Not kind of frustrating, but... Helps get me back into... Th the swing of things. Eh? No. <laughs> yeah, because um, this whole week I basically haven't really done any off-screen or off-stream. But stuff. So I'm kind of rusty again. No. Where? Oh. Okay. Okay. is also on the way. We'll head up that one. I think it's gonna be some nonsense. Oh boy, that's gonna be some nonsense. Alright, this one that I can just do or Oh boy. Ah. Okay, check it out there. Thankfully, the wind helps with uh, getting back up here. 
but oh boy. What? No. My. Ooh, I have a dangerous bad idea. All right. Okay, if I'm gonna try something <laughs> like this, let's let's wait until I can actually make it look partially decent. Come on. All right, now I think I have to go down or top to bottom. All right. Hmm. I don't think I need to, but I just think it'll be easier to this way. Ah. Oh. I've done this one before, I know I have, it's just a weird one to do. <clears throat> because if you tilt up at all, you kind of get... Whoa. Oh, come on. Also, wonder if I can get any uh, feats while doing this. Because, oddly enough, gonna give this a few more tries before just trying this later. Just... <sighs> Alright, now it all 
try this one. Once more. If I don't get it, then I'll just do it off stream, trying to make a clip of it. Because I feel like I can do this one. No, I have done this one. But. For some reason, I cannot fly. Okay, I think. Okay, now I said I'll do this. Just that one more time. So let's actually. Uh, let's see what this is about. Then let's actually go blow shit up. just need to be, uh, connected. Now. Can you attach our stunt person to the vehicle with your gear? So cool! Thank you, Rico! Oh, okay. And now some of those are different than just attach someone to a vehicle, which is such a weird non hey, kid, side quest. We're gonna get through that lightning storm. We need. Uh, anyway, this is what I wanted to do. Um, not. Can I? <sighs> OJ, spread your wings, Rico. Hey, hey, Cass. Great to see you. And yes. What in the world? <clears throat> Comrade orbs. They are under control huh? of the. Uh... Hmm. <clears throat> Under the control of the chaos, the Army of Chaos Resistance Group, therefore, they are uh, secure and do not need to be liberated. Is my uh, justification for not sending them to Skywar? Whoa! He just. Goodbye. Oh. Back to your post. Target is gone. No. Possible disturbance. How is this not out. flying? Be gone. We've lost the target. Stand down for now. So, uh, not as secured as I was hoping it would be. Then again, the front line isn't... ...isn't as far away from here as I would like it to be. Speaking of which, let's get...
Let's go Nico, take we over intercepted some intelligence another the Black base. Are planning to rig Puerto to you to explode if we move in. Can you uh, scout it out for us? See, si. I'll let you know when I'm in the area. <laughs> All right. So a port needs to be captured. No visual on target. Cool. Command advice. Command here. Find that hostile. <sighs> Puerto Tuyo is a ghost town. The Black Hand must have evacuated. How do I find these bombs? Transmitter at the Black Hand guard post. Let me in, and I'll take a look. Their support is en route. No further contact. All units, stay alert. Comrade Orb has not been spotted. So yeah, let's just head. Ah, to this guard no house. one here either. Easy. Go. There are eight vehicles. Simple fuses. Submerging them should defuse them. Mierda. Freak up, they're armed. Shit. A booby trap. You got minutes, Hefe. Get as many in the water as you can. We gotta save that harbor. That's a bomb. Get it into the water. Uh, into the harbor, you say. Uh, that's not what I meant to do, but all right. Okay, game. Okay. Very much asking. What? Okay, it did it. Crash and die there. That's good. That's always good. I warped underwater. That's not so good. Um. Yeah. Let's go. Okay. Sure. <laughs> that was something. Sure was a thing. Keep at it, Rico. Halfway there. first time I was doing this, I was incredibly frantic. Then again, I had no idea what would happen, and I got caught up in some cars, but, like... I think I remember trying to link several cars together, and it just... did not want to work. What? 
Okay. Sure. <laughs> Okay. Alright. Okay, I thought that was my tenth one. One minute uh, left. one. Oh, cool. Need to <laughs> skip over the water. Carajo. Nice. Close, huh? Fuse is shorted on the rest. Looks like they were talking to each other. Broke the circuit. Okay? No more bombs. Oh, bacano. Alright. That, unfortunately, wasn't that interesting. But we got more boat. No more bums. The bums are gone. The, the bottom. <laughs> no more bums. Um. Uh, care. On the target. Searching. Calling off search for oh, hostile. Shit. Resume regular patrols. It does not like me doing that. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh no, it's been attacked. <laughs> Another what? one of those spying bastardos down. Gracias, Rico. Head on to another region. Hopefully, with more uh, orbs. Alright, let me use my special eyes to see if there's any of these van, this van that it wants me to use. Van spotted. 
I may have to do some nonsense to be able to get this to make the jump, but... We'll see how it goes. I wish I could turn on the radio. Stretch my legs. Is there... Um, excuse me, comrades. Um, actually, I think... If I'm... What? Alright. Let me... Okay, I can't bend that to my whims. But, um, okay, still I have an idea. Let's get a little bit creative. Um, not automatic, low, medium, let's, let's do low, let's be safe. Acceleration. medium. Let's <laughs> let's let's not jump the gun too much. Um you know what? In case I need more power. Alright. Hopefully this doesn't, uh, send my car flying. Coming. There's your shot, Garland! Alright, that took some, uh... Ah, uh, do I need to be in a helicopter for that to work? Now I... Okay, before I abandon my van... Ah... Uh, Now, Van, you served me well. All right, now let's uh, get out of here. Okay. No, 
Let's do this one, actually. Let's do a story one. It looks like it's time for another weird cutscene. Yeah, no. Nothing weird, it's just not graphically amazing cutscene. Let's get it in by 0500, yeah? Alright, we're ready. Let's get going. The last of the storm chaser equipment is being loaded. What about the data I extracted? Did you learn anything? Cesar's UFO? I was right. It's one of the prototype cores, only this one is mobile. It works by disrupting the surrounding air temperature. And then this machine creates an artificial updraft, and... Moments later... A tornado rips to Solis. Espinosa is testing a weather weapon on his own people. And he tells us Iapa will be our salvation. <laughs> pues. We can't control the tornado core from here, but if you can plug this into the core's flight controller, then I can hijack it and remotely cyber is linked to the IAPA network. You need to be close for this to work. Ever fight near a tornado? Ever dive into one? <laughs> Where is Cesar? I thought he would be here by now. Oh, I'm not sure he's ready for all this just yet. <laughs> we taking bets? Did you get everything I asked for? Claro que sí. Ultrasonic anemometer. Yes. Image console. Say so. CB antenna. All the gear you requested is good to go. Hmm? I'll fly. I'm not so sure about this. I'll fly the helicopter to Prisa Auto. Agale! You sound sure to me. Okay. But you've never flown with him. Let's go build a storm chaser. But yeah, as I was saying earlier, it's just, it's a weird shame that, like, you know, like a game like this kind of gains a lot from its presentation, and it's just the graphics, especially during cutscenes, just look kind of weird. You've flown one of those before, right? Uh, taking a minute to adjust to the pendulum effect. Here we go. Guys, the Black Hand are setting up roadblocks. Be careful. Are they going to shoot at us? Not if I have anything to say about it. Hey, uh, have you ever read Mechanical Failure? You trying to tell me something? What? No, no. It's a good book. We're good. When I flew from Savion, I would pre-flight every aircraft. Bien, Cesar. I was a great pilot, but uh, when you see an alien spacecraft during a routine flight and you report it, but they don't listen, so you divert your flights to get photos and you show them photos, but they still say you're insane. Well... You get fired? See? You get fired. But once we catch that tornado and pin down this spacecraft inside, and the whole world knows Espinosa's an alien, then we'll see who's left. But if he's not an alien? See. Rico, Cesar, we're detecting surface to air missile launchers ahead. What? Just hang back, Cesar. I'll deal with the Sams. Command, we have an intruder on site. Oh. Copy on hostile contact. We're doing Alright. Who's. Who's shooting me? Oh, you, you just had him. Let's go. 
one. Let's get that a bit further away from the gas station. Tank units. You're clear, Cesar. Listo. Oh, God. Oh, uh -huh. hey. What? You know, I haven't really shown it off. During uh, this playthrough yet, but a scary thing about tanks in this game is that if you try to just send them off to the sky, it's comrade. Enemy choppers headed to your position. Dios mío, they're coming after me. Cesar, listen to me. Just keep flying, and I'll cover you. You can do this. Just keep flying. See. Okay, or I can do this. Burning with. Flames of revolution. Also, I back to our. I will come back for you, friend. I have other duties. Yes, it's it's free. <laughs> we free Comrade Orb. Comrade or liberated. Um, let's go. You're coming up on another cluster of Kinda Sam, slow going in the tank, but like... stop. Entering a holding pattern and awaiting the all clear. See, I'll take care of it. Rocket launchers. Okay, I think I have enough coverage. It like could just destroy these, but in case enemy helicopters come flying by me.
Okay, fine. Clear Cesar. If I can chat at all right. Guys, we've got some friendly anti-air up ahead. They'll keep the black hand off your back once you're past them. You. <laughs> Goodbye, asshole. All right, now... Free of the black hand now. Heading to Prisa Auto. You did good, Cesar. Did I? Bien. Let's get that weather equipment in sight so you can get to work. Buddy. Getting into position. With the weather tracking equipment installed, it brings the total vehicle weight to 7,500 kilos. Very nice. Windproof. But we still need to insulate the interior with tin foil. Ah, the, these cutscenes. Uh, see? In the back. Why would we need to insulate the storm chaser with tin foil? Um, reptilians have been documented using weaponized gamma radiation. Uh, Pero. Tin foil won't help. You need at least two inches of lead shielding to stop gamma rays. Oh. Okay. Everyone back to work. She looks good. Composite plating. Do you want with tempered glass? I thought we needed an upgrade after they started shooting at us. Horsepower? 625. Th does that happen a lot? Want me getting shot at? No, not really. Yes. All the time. You'll probably want to get used to it too, huh? Uh, how do I do that? I don't know. 
Get shot at more? <sighs> no tape deck. I didn't think it was important. You don't think music's important? I thought that building a tornado-proof storm chaser was more important. Yeah, no, I, I guess music is important too, sure. Bueno. Let me know when she's actually ready, hmm? Okay, so I'll, I'll just put in a tape deck then and... practice getting shot at more. You know what, it's... I wish the qualities of the cutscenes were much better. Because, like, I can see th some of these scenes, like, in an action movie and being really fun, but it's just the kind of weirdness to them, like, to the graphics and, like, Rico's beard, well, still looks weird during gameplay, but you don't really notice it too much. But, yeah, so, uh, that was a successful mission. We've helped Cesar get to where he needed to be. Uh, we've liberated yet another comrade orb. Life's good. I need a whole bunch of credits with her. Alright. Um, Thunder Cage. The Diversion. Okay, so I need to push down here anyway. Alright. I'm cool with that. Hmm. Alright, I think... Hmm. Is there any that would give me a free... Oh, this would give me a free one. Let's hit it up. And it shouldn't be too hard to get to. Alright. <laughs> Gosh. Uh. <laughs> Still just thinking about the beginning of the stream. That was me kind of faffing about trying to do some of the, uh, the wingsuit stunts. It was an honor to fly you, Hefe. Um. Because I think I am much, much closer towards... That's it! That's the shot! Um, no, let's do one of these. Er Oiga, Rico. I'm marking a black hand counterintelligence vehicle in your area. Could have a list of operatives in it. Once you've got it, I'll mark a spot where some of our soldiers can break it down. Oh. Almost oof. Yeah, now I, I should play this more off stream just so that I don't. so that my uh, flying skills stay sharp. If you don't mind. Bonk. Perfectly delivering the car. Oh. Uh. Nah, that's the kind of like fictional talk show kind of deal, but just that sound effect just made me not want to listen to it. Uh, that's exactly how <laughs> that works. Um, Alright.
I was, I was hoping that delivering the vehicle would be, you know, where all the peeps are stationed at, but alright. Wait, how far? One point. Sarah, you know what? You know what? I think... <laughs> Sorry, comrades. I'm, I got bored. Let's actually do something, because I feel like... This. Uh, oh, I missed. Alright. Well... Upgrade my wingsuit. Like, immediately. And that... Feels a whole lot more important than uh being Did you able wink nice. at the camera? <laughs> you cheeky boy. Also Alright. Now let's get back on track on kicking ass and taking names. to power the construction of Yapa. Tons of outages ever since. And we've got a good idea how to jam up the works and bring the power back to the people who pay for it. All right. Take over. Let's take back the power plant. Them. Orb. The floodgates have been sealed shut since El Abismo. They're storing up the water, Orb. holding Orb. back a lot of energy. Orb. We think they may be trying to slow us down by rationing power in the region. Whatever the reason, if they want the floodgates closed, we want them open. Head to the power station at the center of the reservoir. Okay, it gets popped if I try it over there. Please, or when is the next Australian federal election? <laughs> um, ah, that explains it. Helium, explosive height. No, okay, no, I want helium. Standing by, get me a target, people. Why is it popping? Okay, I think something's weird going on. Why is it popping? Okay. Comrade Orb, why can't you be freed? It is your shackles.
What? What? I've not freed Comrade Orb before. No! What's going on here? Is this what's messing up? Be freed. Also, I'm sorry that the Australian uh, elections aren't <laughs> until 2022, <laughs> uh, I guess. But. Also, I'm sorry that you hate your uh, current election stuff, but mood. I mean, we got to vote, but like. Oh, that's, uh... <laughs> what if they called it... No, I'm gonna fully attribute, attribute this to you. Uh, Cassidy Cosplay. What if they called it a Hornycopter? Then it'd be... Incredibly horny. Hell yes. Elevators out of order. Carajo. Black Hand must keep it locked from somewhere else to prevent unauthorized access. Here, try this console. What? Yeah. Excuse me. trying to hack into? I kind of got distracted. Oh, it's over there. Gotcha. Then easy. All unit, hold position. Please stop. Elevators open. <laughs> if we take out the generators down there, the turbines lock 
making the floodgates shut will be vulnerable. Generators are behind blast doors. Alright, any other turrets or nonsense up here? Not that I can see. Let's go. God. Still thinking about the morning after. Your mind. Stand by for more I think that's okay. I was about to say, I think that's destroyed. Generators are gone. Yeah, head topside. I've marked your targets. Once the last turbine is gone, we can open the floodgates. Right. Destroying the turbines. Wait. How do I get to them? Oh. I'm guessing they're up here. The turbines is locked behind a blast door. Try looking for another way in. Maybe underwater. Underwater. Fine.
Okay, that's that's no comrade orb, but seeing those things basically become rockets is still good. The last turbine. All that's left is to open up the floodgates. Once 
the water's flowing again, we'll be able to turn the lights on for thousands of people. You can hear me. I forgot about the invisible dudes. Then again, that makes sense. Was too close. All right. All right. That's fair. That's fair. <laughs> oh, you know what? Well, I get back to what I was doing. Um, gas. Uh, I remember, like, you said, like, like oh, good job. Uh, you know. Uh, taken out as like head state for the United States government, and I mentioned like later that like in this game you're actually not working for the United States government, and I found out that like the DLC that has you fighting explicitly against the nice uh, fighting its agency. Like, part of that is also, you're fighting against other people with your wing- that can, like, zip around in a wingsuit. Which is just really, like, funny to me. It's, like, really funny, but also really neat, because they can also just zip everywhere. So, yeah, they're basically American ninjas. And, like, they're like, the United States is explicitly going after you Here for, we go. you know, no longer dismantling dictatorships yeah, explicitly for the United States Army. But... With this dumb now. Mission accomplished, Rico. Oof. Okay. I need this. Helicopter inbound. Getting to AO. Oh yeah, come on. He's in a helicopter. We read you. Enemy in a helicopter. job. Alright, I hope you have a great lunch, Cass. Thanks. Uh. Alright, that front line advanced. Like almost half of Solis is now under our control. Oh, this unlocks a lightning gun. Oh. I still think I want to focus on. Okay, no, I totally want to head up that one. The Dawnflower. <laughs> no, I'll probably do that. How much time I have? Like, still, like, less than an hour? Oh, yeah, let's... No, let's do this one on the way. Alright, um... Uh, that one would give me a 
plus one anyway. No, oh, yeah, let's. Take this. Push the front line. Yeah. Actually... How far? It doesn't show up on the map how far it is. Lovely. Actually, I think I have an idea where it is. Okay, no. Alright. Actually, I think it's somewhere over here. Anyway, let's... Take an assault helicopter and park it. Do uh, some driving before we go ham again. Target is at large. Reestablish visual. Ventilation system. Well, let's <laughs> let's <laughs> let's have the mission before these like cameramen get attacked. The camera, like the film crew. All right. There's a sun car. Uh, before I do that, though, I just want to check Hey, Rico, something. we got a setback here. Black Hand got their hands on our stunt buggy. Calling it mm. evidence. Right. That's no problem, is it? Yeah, no. Hey, you, leave now. Engaging target. A little girl is sick somewhere in the rainforest. Our hero, Rico Rodriguez, has obtained a flower that only blooms at dawn. It can cure her illness, but if... This isn't your movie about me? Sure, sure, it's a MacGuffin, but it gets us a harrowing drive through the windy roads of the rainforest. Haha! <laughs> Lovely. Gadlin's a weird character, but I kind of love her bizarre energy. Also, how invincible this car is. This song is great. I wish you could listen to this on the radio. Like, please. Let me jam out to this. edit out the part of me uh, bashing my face into a tree, but... Hell yes. You're doing good! Just, just try and get the sense of urgency in that weathered manly visage. You're the new masculinity, Rico. Just let me drive, Garland.
Alright, coming up on the end. Onto the sailboat where the little girl has lain in quarantine these past three years of her young life. <laughs> Don't fuck up the jump. Don't fuck up the jump. Eh, not bad. We got miniatures to pick up the rest. <laughs> and hey, remind me later to show you the action figure. Tie-ins! Kids will love it! No, it'll be, it'll be edited. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Oh shit! You go off in the drink. To the ancient people who believed in a favorite lake of the goddess. Okay, yeah, that temple somewhere around here, but I think this is. I mean, I would take this, but what do you get for? Oh, you get a jet fighter. Oh, oh, that's it. We're gonna hit this up. Okay. You know what? Never mind. Uh, because I need. Oh. Oscar's lightning research facilities. If we can get our hands on some of its weather data, it could get us closer to destroying Project Diapa. Makes sense. I'll contact you when I'm there. Chilling with me. All right, let's raise hell. I'm at Medio Lab, Sargento. What do we have on this place? The lab uses a rigid airship to collect important weather data for Project Diapa. We just need to release the airship above the base and let it do its thing. Get to the hangar where they store the airship. Air support is on. Of helium. 
You're having a fun time. Let's go. Hangar is locked down. Ugh, nothing's ever easy, is it, Coppa? <laughs> Any ideas, Izzy? There are some consoles around the facility that work as safety locks for the airship. Show me the way. Supply drop. Oye, Rico, supply drop inbound. Okay, pull up my friendly. I had to blow up my friendly, uh, helper. I unlocked. Good. Now oh, hurry sure. and do the others before they all reset. They reset? Just move. this incredibly hard for myself, but, uh, fuck it. Unlocked. The console to release the airship is over there. Let's go. 
you're going there. shot left. Let's try to make a count. Or, um... This will make some noise. Releasing the airship. Whew. Alright, I got my second, but got third. And there it goes. You'll have to get close to a Paresi to get the data. I can do that. Easy, I'm in range. Your turn. Stay close to that thing. Rico! Rico! Shito! I'm working! What is it, Sargento? The Black Hand has troubled the jet. They're targeting the airship. Easy. How much time do you need? More! Don't move! Okay, they're God not oh. letting me... I'm not done. Stay close to the console. Working on it. Uh... That's it. Got it. You're good, right, Rico? Toro va bien, easy. Um... Get that data to Mira and see what she can do with it. Second just cause you could shoot out like the windows of helicopters. Yeah. Oh. 
Alright. Now that... Oh. Oh, come on. Alright, but now that I've perished, we can take over this. And we can now summon forth uh, the lightning gun from our supply drops, which I think is going to be really fun. Actually, let's do that now. Let's see here. See? Dropping supplies now. some wingsuit challenges while we're here. And then, I think, hit up. Okay, that's gonna be kind of weird. Hey! <clears throat> hey, SS! We just liberated another area. Uh, actually, we made quite a bit of progress. Let's see here. We've taken over this region. Uh... I think we moved up here as well earlier. We took out the, uh, capture the Islas Cleopas and had enough, uh, squads or had enough troops to take over Cantos. And we helped the dude who saw the, like, the, the weird, like, weather machine equipment back in the 70s, or the prototype. Uh, we saw him, or we helped him get some equipment to build his cool weather chaser that we're gonna drive fairly soon. But I think first I want to do some of this and then hit up this story mission. Okay, I think this is less of a story mission, more of like... No, I... Yeah, I think I'll just do some of the... stuff because I just need 10 more wingsuit missions and uh, then the wingsuit will be fully upgraded. Ah, yes. <laughs> Superman 64. Yes, we're playing Superman 64. Fly through my wings, that uh, my rings, <laughs> Rico. Where's the other rings? Are they? Ah, they're down there. But yeah, we're doing some of this because having uh, jet boosters and missiles on our wingsuit is good. It's good. It's just real good. That's it! That's the shot! Let's see here. 
And one more that's over here. I'm going to ignore that helicopter and have faith in my troops that they can take it out. Well, I fly through some rings for a director. That was ha, easy. just incredibly easy. Oh. Speed stun. Oh, wait. I think I want to do this one. Because I don't drive cars often in this game, but if this is the mission I think it is, then that would mean... I get to unlock that car, and that supercar just goes incredibly fast, like faster than has any right being. Like you, you step on the gas, and it can go like to 90 uh, kilometers, just like a minute or not a minute, an hour. At just like. Two seconds or something. That said, if this is one of those missions that are like, ah, that, you know, you unlock it, you usually. usually means that it's somewhere around. Ah, there it is. Alright. Nice ride. Alright, can I fit this? Okay, yeah, this... I am good! That unlock it? Hey, cool, I got a new booster mod, but... Hey, was nice. Kids, we found this thing called an ion coil. Mira says it's exactly what we need for our lightning-proof boat. Swing by Media Lab. Give us a hand. Your support is on route. All right. Announced so that wasn't the one to unlock it. Uh. Oh, what? Let's... No, while we're here... Um... Trying to think. What do I want to hit up first? You know what? While I'm here. And so that... Doing this will, uh... Despawn <laughs> these enemies in here. A lot more than, than I want there to be. Ah... Uh, let's do another walkie cutscene. God, I wish I uh, just just casually steal a flat cannon. Yeah, just all you know, always casually steal a flat cannon. You know, they just have a little hatch on them. And you just pop it open. You hop in. Easy, it's see. great. Mhm. Mm According to the data you retrieved, the ion coil in here creates positive streamers, which stimulate electrical storms. So it makes lightning. Uh, no. It creates a positive charge, which draws negative charges to it. So, lightning will strike the ion coil and not anything around it. So it absorbs lightning. How do we get it out of there? We need to get around a failsafe system. There are lightning rods protecting this area. Deploy those rods and the failsafes release the coil. Lightning rods? I thought you said this thing absorbs lightning. If Mira says it'll work, it'll work. I know, I'm just messing with her. I'll go raise the lightning rods. He used to be a lot easier to get along with. We get along fine. <sighs> Come on, let's get inside. I wish these cutscenes were better done. I, I I don't know. Like, I can easily imagine them in a really fun action movie. But I wish they looked better. Storm's rolling in. Oh boy. Force oh their no. rods up. That should trigger the failsafe and release the coil. Stormy. Uh. Let's 
take this. Oh boy. Uh, Found the first lightning rod. There should be a breaker nearby. Leaping it will force the rod up. Oh yeah, I forgot. There's one. Yeah. Staying near an active rod will protect you from lightning strikes. Oh god. <laughs> Thanks, game, for interrupting your own explanation for another explanation. But yeah, lightning strikes target. Uh, lightning strikes targets. Lightning strikes targets that are higher up. Stay low and move fast to avoid lightning when it's about to strike. Uh, deploy the rods to track lightning, protecting their immediate. If I'm vicinity. not near one, without a positive charge, the negative charge. Move it or lose it, kid. If you're about to get struck right. by lightning, Rico, just move as fast and as far as you can. Move fast. Copy. Good thing I have this fucking jetpack. How's it going out there? Oh god, I'm about to be hit. You ever tried wrapping yourself and up I'm... in your parachute like a poncho? Uh. Of course, that wouldn't help with the lightning. Sheldon? And this one is up too. Just one more to go. Alright. Yeah, uh, if you play for a while, you know. Found the last see... lightning rod. Ooh. Yeah, if you see uh, electricity crackling around you, that means uh, move, do something, do anything. Last lightning is up. Yeah, lightning, lightning hurts. <laughs> I don't know if it's, it's a kill. I think it's. Oh god. Shit. What is it? Coffee's too hot. Burn my mouth. But yeah, get to that console. Oh, oh god. Jesus oh. Rico, Ooh. you alright? Okay, not an instant kill. Oh, yeah. Because this your action moving right. protagonist. But it hurts. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, you, you gotta move fast when that lightning's about to strike, kid. Lay down lightning storm. Fly across the ground, mate. Go through your organs instead. My clip. Good no. Good no, I kind of forgot about that. I think. Oh god. Fuck. Fuck, I hate lightning in this game. It just. Because, because of the stormy weather, you also move slower. Looks like the lightning rods have gone back down. There's some sort of problem. Hang on. You'll still be safe if you stay near that coil. That's because it absorbs lightning, Rico. Shut up and flip that switch. Oh, yep. There you go. Gracias. Rico, there's just a glitch in the hardware. It's all. Try to signal the lightning rods from that console. Oh, boy. And yeah, I was hoping to not face land, but... Please, game, please don't hit me with lightning. Please, please, please. Okay. Oh, thank God. It. The coils. Lightning rods are coming back up. Thing. That should do it. We'll get to work extracting the coil. Hell yeah. We did it, kid. Yeah. Nice teamwork, Sheldon. Now find me a towel. <laughs> yeah, that face plan is good. You look cold. Here. Work with me, kid. I'm living up to my end of the bargain. <laughs> you and me? We've got a long way to go. How many deposed dictators later? And you're still the same asshole you were at 17. If I were 17, I wouldn't feel so banged up right now. You remember when you used to dress like a Mexican Johnny Cash? What's wrong with Johnny Cash? Nothing. There's nothing wrong with Johnny Cash. It's just not the most practical way to dress for a war. 
Whatever you say, hula shirt. Well, there's nothing wrong with a hula shirt. Hey, just not the most practical way to dress for a war. Give me that. And yeah, it's suddenly it's a bright day. And also, yeah, Rico would dispose dictators. What, apparently when he's 17. I, I think that's how old he was, or... I, I don't know how old he was in the first Just Cause. And I played Just Cause 2, in which he realized, like, oh no, disposing dictators. You know, like, these dudes suck, but doing it for the, for the sake of the United States of America is bad, actually. And, like, he leaves the agency. And then the third game, he goes back to his homeland called Medici, which is a Mediterranean island nation, and helps liberate them. But, like, Tom Sheldon, like, betrays him multiple times, you know, for, like, things that the agency wants. And this time, seemingly, they have, they're both out. And also, a kitty cat wanting pets and attention. Which is nice. And no, I am like hmm. I am debating whether or not to do another mission. This one's locked. What does it need? Secure the Delta Real One region. Ah, it's right here. Oh, and apparently I get a rocket launcher if I uh, free that region. Oh, advance the region through invasion there. Oh, you can lock a railgun? Hell yeah. But yeah, I think that will... Either that or coming back down here will be what I do next time. But yeah. <laughs> so <laughs> You came ash ash towards the uh, tail end of the stream, but yeah. I. Not. That's fine. Drone activity. Uh, investigate the area. Not. Yeah. Yeah, being a little bit short under time isn't bad. Because I was thinking of doing one more mission, but. I can see that for next stream. And also... Oh. Thanks so much. But, yeah. Next time, we're gonna do some more story stuff and explode more, uh... oppressive playstate government goons. With the rocket launchers, or from the missile pods my fucking wingsuit that has jet boosters on it. This game is great. Okay, this game has a lot of issues, especially with its cutscenes being kind of jank, but, like, this game's good, actually. Like, it's actually really fun. Yeah, I am basically discount Iron Man. At this point. And like, no, that's not a bad thing. We're we're weird spy Iron Man. God, this looks up. All right, hope you have a lovely dinner. So nice. Ciao, Eshush. Yeah. This now this has been fun stream, even though I faffed about in the beginning, but yeah. Fun times. Fun times. Ah, <laughs> should But yeah. I no yeah, I should still do sign off, but yeah, thanks for watching. And uh, yeah. Try to stream this again. Same 
squirrel time, same squirrel channel. Uh, no. I'm still going with the idea of Rico having a flying squirrel persona. One day I need to commission art of that, because that, that, that just tickles my fancy. But yeah. Good night, everyone. <laughs>